Now I'm gonna say Chris. No, I'm gonna say Crystal. Go and follow me on my Namaste Crystal channel. That's my second channel for um, Sagittarius, which is in my moon. Um, I am giving away 50% off all readings until the end of Pisces season. Same day readings. All right, so Spirit, what do we have for Pisces? Next 48. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Pisces. All right, the Page of Pentacles and the Two of Pentacles, so definitely a choice that needs to be made, okay? Um, <clears throat> Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, someone might have that in their chart. They're taking their time. Well, this is you trying to make a decision, but cautious, all right? Trying to tread slowly. Uh, three of Cups, also the um, the Star, and now the Empress. This could be involving a child or a birthing of a, a idea, all right? Or friends, if someone wants to heal things with you. All right, um, you also have the moon and the four swords. Speaking of hidden secrets, Pisces, Cancer energy. And the four swords is definitely a Libra energy, okay? It could be Aquarius, Libra, Gemini with the star here. We have Aquarius. Um, the Empress could be a Libra and a Taurus. So let's see, Pisces, that's 48. All right, someone wants to come out of this third party um, and infidelity here. All right, or lack thereof commitment. The death card in the chariot, okay. Um, so Cancer and definitely a Scorpio here. Um, it is an ending of some sort with someone, it could be a relationship. You have the page of cups reverse at the, I mean, page of cups uh, offer of love, an apology after someone walked away. I'm seeing someone got in their car and just walked away, left the building. Here's the Aquarius, but Gemini could be. I am crazy, but Gemini just got to go away from this connection. Okay. Um, blindsided you. All right. Pisces, next 48. We have the Five of Cups. Someone is definitely missing this connection. Could be you or your partner. If it doesn't resonate, please book a personal. All right. Um, Pisces, take the pieces and leave the rest. You have the Page of uh, Cups here. An apology. You have the lovers before we get to this card. All right, so you have an apology to lovers, and you also have temperance, Sagittarius, and then you have the will of karma. So this is like an in, in and out cycle, a continuation of fighting or arguing with someone you love. Could definitely be a Sag. Check out the Sagittarius reading in Gemini that I just completed. You do have the Seven of Swords, so someone wants to stop this bullshit lie here. Seven, seven, seven of wands. God is calling you. You might need to read a verse in Psalms, all right, prayer here. Now, someone could be lying and someone is defensive about the lie. All right, you also have a Leo. It could be a Leo, all right? Um, so, let's see. What's the final love advice for my Pisces that we need to know? The Hermit. So, someone is searching for love here, all right? After walking away. Someone could be returning, all right? But this is the Eight of Cups walking away. So, Pisces, you might walk away from this connection because it's just draining. It's also... Causing you to grow old here. <clears throat> and that and that road is lonely. Okay. Normally the hermit has like this lonely road. That that road is lonely, honey. Okay, let's clarify. You have the justice, so the justice is in your favor. You might be dealing with again a Libra. Alright. And another card here we have the King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So Pisces, it might be your energy um, missing someone from your past, and here you are, the five, the high priestess reversed with the five of wands. So it's, it's definitely a fight. It was a disagreement, all right, a big fight, a big showdown, and someone just went quiet here, okay? Now, after the quiet period, someone is missing, all right? So this could be you or your partner, so put the pieces how you see fit, and please leave the rest now. This is the future, so we're going to do a long extended reading. So we're going to clarify that as well because the, um, the High Priestess, the Five of Cups, and my beautiful um, King of Cups is there. And you have the Five of Wands. Conflict is here, okay? Five of Cups. So someone is definitely missing. But it's only after all this bickering and fighting that they realize your worth, okay? They perhaps even look at the Two of Cups at the bottom. At the bottom of the deck is reversed because someone, you guys were soulmates. But someone didn't see and value it when it was there living in the house. And only until, you know, they was able to, they had to leave or they found another partner. And a partner couldn't match up to you, Pisces. All right, so let's see. Why is the Two of Pentacles here for my lovely Pisces? 
King of Wands. There's Wands. Here's the Osage is here. Alright, so someone please ring the bell to Sagittarius. They think they got time. You need to make a decision, Sagittarius. Aries Leo. Here's a page of pentacles. Someone wants to offer you a small beginning. A, sh a short. Someone wants to really talk. Alright, so here's the king of pentacles and a strength. Alright, someone's afraid to come forward. I think someone's afraid of rejection. King of pentacles. Alright, so Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Leo. Now we have the Empress here, a Libra or Taurus. Why is this here? Alright, this is the, um, so if you're dealing with a Libra or Taurus, they're single or Virgo. They're not dating anyone, and if they are, they're just, they're just curious. Why is the star here? Was that a flipper? Why is the star here? Okay, defeat, 5-5. Five, five. I keep getting double numbers. 5-5, five, five. defeat. So definitely someone feels defeated here, all right? Um, an apology that needs to be said here, all right? Um, the, the star to me is an apology. Well, someone wants to apologize because they know you're important. Why is the three of cups here first? Hang out with friends. The hermit. So someone needs to come out of hermit mode and get out. Put on your best dress. Have a drink, you know, hang out and mingle with your family and friends for your birthday, okay? Don't let someone make you feel defeated or make you feel unworthy is what I'm getting. Why is the moon here? Holding on tight to this connection. Alright, so someone could be holding on tight even to this lie. The moon here, Pisces, Cancer, Energy, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, anyone. Why is the four swords, Gemini, Libra, anyone? Leo. Why is the four swords, Sage? Book of personal. So you have the six of pentacles reverse. Not having this equal balance, I'm telling you. So and someone is saying they want to break, but they're not even they even in a break, they're not coming to reality. Nothing is dawning on them. You see? They still lost here. Sleeping men, sleeping women here. So you have a beginning and an ending. This is the Aries and the Pisces is the ending of tarot. And you have this um this broken heart and the sleepless night. So it's an ending. To this pain, Pisces, okay? You just need to come on out of that shit. Don't lay stuck with this chariot. This could also be a cancer here. You have two, ma two major arcanas just clarifying a, 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 the chariot. So another Pisces, Cancer, and Aries here. Someone is definitely crying over this connection. Alright? It, it can be you or your partner, Pisces, but put the story how you see fit. Someone is definitely wishing they took this leap of faith towards you. All right, but it's a quiet here because you're not responding, and someone is like I said before in another reading, you're dead to me. I'm dead. You're dead. I'm done. You're dead to me. Or well, someone dead at the connection. Why is the death card here? All right, and the two, yeah, not communicating. It's a towel moment here. Someone definitely is gonna dead this connection, or already have. Now the future of the reading is here, so this could be currently happening. A big blow up, a big showdown, a big fight. And here's this sneaky, conniving king of swords, a crazy bit Gemini. Someone is using their head to, to figure things out. They could be trying to um, investigate you. Why is the knight of swords here? Dominion. Someone is controlling. Okay, and you have the queen of swords reversed. Someone is definitely controlling. Alright, so if you are dealing with the crazy bit Gemini, they're reversed here. They might be sneaky, trying to pull a, 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 a big one on you, um, Pisces males. If you are female uh, Pisces, you do have a Knight of Swords. Alright, so someone might rush in to offer, offer you the stability here, I see. And then kind of just not even do what they promised, alright, um, Pisces. Now, this could be you, Pisces, laying in this, or this could be your partner. Someone is in this pain and someone will be hurt. That is the that is that's happening literally right now. Okay, so here's the hermit. Why is the hermit here for the Pisces? The magician. So you have Gemini, Virgo. Very heavy Virgo, Gemini. Alright, and there's Gemini here. Um searching. Alright. Let's see. Why is the King of Cups here for um Pisces future seven of swords so someone cannot you or this could be you not trusting someone or someone doesn't trust you 
It could be a Virgo, Gemini, another Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Sagittarius. Now, here's the lovers and the will of karma. So, some, it's an in and out love. You have the lovers plus the two of cups and soulmates reversed. This is a twin flame. Why is the lovers? It might feel like a soulmate. Why is the lovers here? Mm hmm So, you have the sun and the ten of cups. So, this is definitely someone who is not here for a long time. Uh, Pisces. So you need to be careful who you who you bring into your house in the next seven days. Okay. Queen of Cups is also reversed. The Two of Cups again, and the pe Ace of Pentacles. So you need to be careful, Pisces. Someone might try to say they love you just to get you in bed. Why is the Wheel of Karma here? Yeah, to a fool here. So someone trying to fool you, or someone wound up being a fool. All right, trying to play this this game with you, Pisces, and they're going to get caught. All right, the justice is in your favor. Why is the justice here? All right, it's a Libra energy. Knight of Cups, yeah. And the Eight of Sewers. Oops. Okay, so Pisces, this could be you. Don't play, don't become a puppet or have someone walk all over you like a carpet. All right, um, that's what I'm seeing here. Now, you could be having some worry. It could be mental. Why is the Five of Cups here? All right, it's a mental imbalance here, the devil here, child. And then you have the king of pentacles, could also be a Capricorn. All right, who's missing you? All right, or you're missing the Capricorn here. Or this could be you obsessing over someone or someone obsessing over you. Why is the high priestess here? Well, queen of pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. So maybe both of you are obsessing over each other here. Okay. Now you have the page of cups, the temperance, and the eight of cups. So someone did walk away. Why is the page of cups here for Pisces? Queen of Swords. Page of Cups and a Queen of Swords, Pisces. Someone is stalking you, okay? Um definitely stalking you. Like someone wants to apologize, but I still see like a stalker energy with the devil. Alright, so it could be a crazy bit Gemini, another Pisces Cancer Scorpio or Sag. Why is the temperance here? Like that's the Pisces already. And six of swords. So someone has some more. You, if you're done with the Sagittarius, both of you have some more obstacles to go through before you guys can have a happy medium here. All right. So why is the eight of cups here? Someone is still upset because someone walked away. Is what I'm getting from this whole reading. Someone wants someone to pay. Yeah. All right. It could be an Aries Leo Sag because you have the Queen and King of Wands and the Emperor Aries Leo Sag. Someone wants you to pay. For walking away, breaking their heart. How dare you, Pisces? You will pay. You will suffer for this. You will get your karma. Someone is wishing. Or this could be you, Pisces, wishing that mother lover to get their karma for fucking you over or um, hurting you, Pisces. Alright, so you got the three of wands waiting for your ships to come in. Alright, so let's get your love advice. <laughs> Alright, that ended kind of funny because I was just talking about an Aerosil Sag. And here's all these Aerosil Sag coming towards the end with the two swords. Pisces. Alright, so what's the advice? Okay, so someone be will be victorious. I do like the end. Okay. Victorious. So someone will be able to win someone over and go out to dinner. Alright, to at least talk about this connection. Alright, let's see. Pisces. What's the love advice for my Pisces? Seven of Cups. Let's get one more. Oh. All right, so we have the judgment and the four cups. Pisces, love it, guys. Page of swords. So someone is definitely stalking. <laughs> someone has many options, and someone is definitely stalking here. Someone can't let go. All right, so let's see. Pisces, love it, guys. Here regarding this crazy situation. All right, so your love advice is to have a happy home, ten, ten of cups. This is absolutely beautiful. A happy marriage, happily ever after, emotional contentment, a love relationship with your children, raising children wisely and successfully, people you can trust. Ooh, thank goodness. Pisces, we needed this for real. After all this shenanigans, honey. So I wish you the best. Namaste. God bless.